Are you ready to give up on your dreams life? Hi, Massimo here and I want to tell you that I'm not. Okay? So, uh, I remember that I was searching for my financial independence since I was 13 years old, 14 years old, maybe even earlier, but I started searching for a financial independence uh, for real when I was 13, 14 years old. Yeah. And I remember that I went I went through this newspaper and I saw this this ad telling that uh, there was an opportunity a job opportunity uh, and that uh, in order to do to to start I had um, yeah they were just doing meetings um, in a in a city which was I think 35 or 40 kilometers far away from my home maybe even even more I was living in Gioia Tower at that time, in Calabria, and I had to go to Reggio Calabria, which was uh, quite far, maybe even 50 kilometers. And I was 13, year, 13 years old, and I wanted to understand because the, 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 the other world was really captivating, you know, it was attractive. I don't remember how, how it was done, but it, something clicked in my mind, okay? So I. Uh, at that time, um, I was uh, was living uh, in that period of time with my grandparents, and and yeah, and what what happened was that I don't know how I convinced my grandparents to let me go alone in this meeting, and the meeting was in the evening. We are speaking more than thirty years ago. I don't tell you how how old am I. You can find it. You can find it out from my Facebook profile. So, basically, what happened is that you know, one way or the other, I I, I managed to go uh, in this um, this town, in this city, because uh, it was really really far, and the meeting was in the evening, and so I had to organize how to take to, to take the, the train going and back. So I had to spend some money. You have always to spend some money in order to start something that you want to do by yourself, always. Um, anyway, just also for the ticket, train ticket, I had to go there and then to come back. And and yes, then I, I, I called this guy and said, okay, I, I'm coming to the meeting and so on. And I remember that um, I went, I was searching. At that time, there was no, no internet. So if you wanted information where to go, you had to ask the people. And so I was just asking to people, oh, hello, could you tell me please where is this, this street and so on. They were quite adventurous times, okay? Nowadays you just have your mobile phone, you write down the street where you want to go and just the, the mobile phone with Google Maps or something or other just drives you there. But that time, what was happening was that I went, sorry, I went just blindly to this meeting and then I saw it was, it was not even an hotel, it was a private apartment, private flat. And then I, I just, um, uh, I just uh, ring it and they told me, I told you, I'm Massimo Bruno and I, I, I came for this meeting because for, for this job opportunity and so on. And they said to me, okay, yeah, come on, come up, we are up and so on and so on. So I entered and the truth was that it, it, was, it was a beautiful uh, home, a beautiful flat, quite, quite, quite beautiful one, okay, a very beautiful home. And I entered and they said they greeted me and so on. They were the husband and the wife, young ones. And so I started asking, sorry, I came here for the meeting and so on, to know about the job. Yeah, yeah you are in the right place, okay, and so on. They offered me something to drink and then uh, the, the husband uh, started telling me if I knew uh, um, if I knew about uh, something about network marketing, multi-level marketing, at that time the name was multi-level marketing, and I said no, I don't know anything about it, and he said okay, 
it's just start. He asked me how old uh, was I. I, th I told him I was 14 or 15, something like this. 13? No, I mean I think 14, 15, something like this. And yes, and what happened was that he then started explaining me, uh, presenting me the, the, this business opportunity the name of the company, the company, the founders of the company, the story of the company and the founders and uh, yeah the founders so I think you already understood most of you, many of you already understood which company I'm speaking uh, of about and yes and started and then he arrived to the marketing plan and he started <coughs> explaining me uh, about marketing plan levels and people one people and if you have five people doing what we are doing and so on and then you have this percentage and so on <coughs> because he was trying at the beginning to explain me in general I, I told him no no please explain me exactly because being one who wanted already to, to earn some money at that age meant that I was smart enough to understand and I was also, and I am also, quite good in math, mathematics. And so he started me explaining the marketing plan. And the more he was explaining, the more I was like, oh, wow. And I was asking, do you mean that if I have these people in my group under me and they do what I'm doing, this percentage is going, I am going to earn this percentage and so on. Yeah, we are just doing some example with some numbers just to let you understand, okay? Okay, okay, and he was he was going deeply and deeply in the, in this in this stuff, and at the end I was like, oh my god, this is an incredible way to make a lot of money, you know, 13, 14 years old, marketing plan was incredible. Um, there was just one thing that was a little bit annoying, which was that every month everything started again from the from from the bottom and. It was quite annoying. I discovered this later, uh, um, and but yeah, I, I I just I was just I was just dreaming. Oh, I yeah, you know the things that a 14, 14 years old boy can dream of. You know, I can get this, I can buy this, I can uh, get the video games that I like, and you know, and then. I don't know. Just I started, I started figuring it out, you know, and dreaming and so on. And then I went at home. I greeted them, and then I, I took all the my papers and I went at home. And you know what? My grandparents asked me the the, the the day, the other day, because it was late when I uh, was back home. Uh, how it was and so on. You know what? I I just saw the plan, marketing plan once. And I explained them the whole marketing plan of that company, and they were like, mm. "My grandmother was really. This is how it works. Yes, this like it works and so on." And my grandfather was a little suspicious and so on, and then called him, called the guy, and he explained to him, "Yes, uh, this and so on and so on." And so on. And then I told them I want I want to start I want to start with this I want to start with this. Um, so I realized that multi-level marketing at that time multi-level marketing I'm not working with that company anymore um, since ages um, was really a great way to make a lot of money and the numbers were just I couldn't sleep that night and I thought ah, this is what I want to do this is what I want to do. You know, and so on, and so um, my grandfather um, got an appointment with the, with the guy, and so on. So we went. He we sp we spoke together. And so he spoke to, to my grandfather, and so on. And he convinced him, him or another, that this was a great opportunity, and so on. And the point was that I was not yet 18 years old, so the code. The, the 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 kit had to be the kit with the products had to be uh, sold to one of them and at that time both of my parents uh, grandparents were um, 
uh, were uh, sellers. My grandfather was selling uh, stuff for um, you know uh, the agriculture, and my grandmother, my grandmother was selling uh, um, uh, was selling uh, I don't know I don't remember the English name stuff for people who, uh, who for the women who had to to marriage you know uh, like. Oh my God! I don't remember the English name. Anyway, she was in the in the commerce uh, as well. And then what happened was that of course I had to to to, to get traffic. So the plan was I will go with this company and I will really. What happened when I, when I got the <laughs> I will go with this company and I will start and I will make a lot of money. I was 14 years ago, old and so excited and then this 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 kit arrived and there was the videotape and i inserted it in in a video recorder at that time and i showed the story of the company because it was the same thing that that guy did with me before uh, uh, to start and show me the marketing plan and what happened was that uh with this video tape first to be convinced to, to, to help me were just my grandparents and they understood that we need, it was about selling and they understood that I needed people and I didn't know I didn't know anyone I was just a, a, a boy you know and then they decided to help me my grandfather decided to help me with the people he knew there in that, in that town little town when we were leaving everyone knew everyone and, and my grandmother decided to come with me to help me to bring me to the people that my grandfather uh, were was um, uh, was contacting and I had to do the demonstration the product demonstrations which were quite cool because I remember really cool products you know they are they exist uh, nowadays of course the company is still existing is one of the greatest company the most new known company about selling everything with multi-level marketing and of course I'm not going to tell you the name maybe one day I will tell you the name of this company the other, the other company about supplements and so on but not today and what happened was that I was starting and then uh, there was a main problem there were two problems the main problem was that uh, my grandmother started tried to do my job she wanted to do to sell stuff okay but she was doing the, 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 the selling in in a way that was not like I was trying it I mean I went from uh, after that the first uh, evening that I went uh, there and do, I did the meeting I just went and um, and did some training some meetings with other people uh, going uh, the home it, that was that, that, that family that couple were the sponsors of a, a little group and I was in the group and was being trained and I also went into seminars and, and I learned a, a lot about uh, motivation and so on I was I was 14 years old the one the only kid there amongst a lot of adult people and it was quite cool you know and I was asking asking and I remember they were at the end of the meeting the 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 the, the, uh, the, the meeting uh, which was held once uh, in a hotel a seminar and uh, I was like oh wow yes and then that was the first time that I was uh, I heard about self-improvement books for self-improvement and so on and started reading that kind of books and so on something that was really unthinkable for my for the other uh, other boys coming at school with me improvement books what what is this thing <laughs> you know it was quite cool so basically what happened was that there was uh, there was some friction between me and my grand grandmother because she wanted to say in her when I, I I knew that I had to say in another way making product demonstrations and so on like I knew I had to do so we had the, uh, several times we argued one with another and that was the moment there was a moment that when my grandfather told me and I was selling some stuff you know I was selling 
they just the, the, the families uh, who hosted me and my presentation were just making a favor were, were, were being kind with my grandfather and and they were buying something some some someone was buying something here someone was buying something there and so on but then at, at, at one moment people uh, people finished all the people that my my grandfather knew uh, were just finished and end other the, they didn't want to, to to buy other stuff and so on and, and that was the moment when the, the my sponsor told me that it was time to recruit it was time to bring other people who could do the same job because I couldn't do just selling and that's it it doesn't work like this network marketing it was uh, multi-level marketing it was not direct selling and that's it, and that's it. so uh, he told me well, well if you can find people I, I enough people uh, at least 20 people 20 persons and a place where I can do the, the presentation the job yeah the the opportunity presentation the business presentation I will come from Reggio Calabria to Gioia Tauro and I will do it I then spoke with my grandfather look we I want to do this because remember the marketing plan and so on and explain it again so I it doesn't it is not all about selling it is about having other people in in, in my team and so on and so forth uh, and I I push it so that much I don't remember now how but I push it that much that my at the end we went <laughs> to the, the the hotel to one hotel and this the, the hotel uh, the, the owner of the, the owner of the hotel was a friend of my my grandfather and then we contacted a lot of people and maybe because it was a little with the town I don't know more of the story I had something like 50 or 70 people in a hotel room <laughs> I did this and I was helped but everything started from me 14 years old you know that was something unbelievable and then this guy came and we did all the most yeah the business presentation the demonstrations and so on and I went with the products um, doing the the, 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 the the demo and so on he was doing the, the stuff and I was showing to the people going um, uh, amongst them to show you oh look this yeah you can see and yeah you know how the product work and so on and uh, uh, basically I don't remember what happened but I think it it was one of the major flops <laughs> my first time 75 50 70 people i think that some some of them bought products but i don't think that i think that none of them started the business you have to understand that it was more than 30 years ago where people if they don't know you you know they don't trust you and they i think that they came all because this, this friendship um uh this uh, with my grandfather anyway uh, mm, I don't remember maybe someone started um, with the kit and so on and but what happened was that then there was this great friction with my grandmother and at the end and especially when I understood that every every month um, the, uh, I, uh, I it didn't matter where I was you know, in the marketing plan until I didn't reach a certain level I would have started from the beginning every month every month so on. and then simply there were no nobody who were uh, buying my stuff and so on because anyway it was I was I was a kid you know I was a kid and people just were started to be pissed off because I wanted to sell I wanted to recruit I wanted to sell I wanted to recruit and my grandfather start, and my grandmother started telling me hey we cannot go and just annoying people you know and so on so I had this great, uh, great, great, great this great push but 
they were the, the main two. They were, had the contacts, they, you know, and I was just a kid. So if they were, weren't doing the job that I was asking them to do, contact with me and so on, let me speak with people and so on, you know, I will show them the marketing plan, I will show, you know. But anyway, they were my, f at the beginning, the people, they thought that I was taking this like a like, like a game, you know. And when he will, uh, I don't, I, I, we are sure that at a certain point he will stop and that's it. No, I was just pushing them so that they could push other people. Anyway, and then they were pissed off, and I was pissed off, and also because of this trick, kind of trick of the marketing plan. And at the end, they say, "Okay, the hell with it." That's and then I didn't want to hear, hear about multi-level marketing anymore. In fact, what happened was that another person from... I had, I think, three, no, three or four um, people contact, contacting me for an, another multi-level marketing opportunity. And when I discovered it was multi-level marketing, I was pissed off because this time I had to go uh, again far away from my little town but and that company uh, is a great company about supplements one of the greatest company supplements company in the world very 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 known and I know that I, I bet that most of many of you already know which company I'm speaking about and I'm still using their products okay at the moment I'm not working with them because what happened it happened that I refused to go to three meetings in um, in an in a, a span of time, and then the fourth time, for some reason that maybe I will explain in another video, I accepted, and I started to be. Uh, I, I was that time with my parents, um, and. It was working. The products were working, and and the the product of the product was my mother. He she lost something like 23 kilograms, and people were like oh, amazing because okay, this is another story. I will tell you another time. And when I saw how, how it was working, I was like, oh my god, why I didn't start? I'm oh, sorry, why I didn't start this earlier? was so stupid just because I had a failure with that first company I I said okay I had to start with this other company way 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 more uh, way 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 earlier really earlier and at, at that time when I started the first time I would have been really in a great position in the marketing in the marketing plan, plan in this company's marketing plan but anyway, that was the first time, and there were there's, there's two problems. People, the, the town was little, people started being annoyed, and I had this friction because my grandmother was telling me, "You are just a kid. I'm in the commercial world. I'm the sale. I'm a saleswoman. I know how to do and so on and so." On. It was not anything that was mine. I just hated it. I hated all of it because of this situation you know but what happened is that I carried on searching for other opportunities other ways to make money legally and I did it I, I, um, I met this other um, multi-level marketing network marketing company it was great then um, I will tell you what happened in another story and now I'm using their supplements and uh, at the moment I'm not um, uh, working as a um, um, uh, network marketer with this company just using um, its products but I still 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 search until I found affiliate marketing and with affiliate marketing I started seeing that I could work online because in the meantime internet the meantime internet appeared and so on and evolved and so on uh, and I could see that I could, uh, at least at the beginning, with affiliate marketing, which is something different than, uh, than network marketing or multi-level marketing, 
uh, with affiliate marketing I could sell stuff online to the entire, entire world um, without without having to directly contact people I mean directly, um, directly push on people and the, the, even if I had to do that the point was that I could do it with social media in a way there is a, such an abundance of people that it didn't matter it didn't really matter that I had if I had to call the people I, 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 in fact at, at the beginning of my affiliate marketing um, um, uh, venture uh, adventure uh, I just started contacting people and yeah, spamming links and so on but con contacting people and this was really a great school I was taking the knowledge of the, my past two network marketing experiences and applying it in, into the personal contact uh, in uh, social media and it was really cool you know okay but I didn't I didn't I didn't know how to contact people but I didn't know how to make people contact me I didn't know how to make people to be interested and so on the there's were things that I discovered lately recently uh, uh, recently when I joined the one final way challenge uh, this challenge uh, this 30 days challenge or better or better I discovered the way how to do this um, uh, yes exactly sorry when I started with the one final way challenge because just at the beginning of the the, the one final way challenge uh, they were just throwing at us throwing us uh, some principles about hacking other offers and so on hacking other ways to do business and so on and I was applying starting applying this principle and I started to see results as I saw as already uh, told in, uh, in other uh, videos so that finally for the first time in my life I could see the money coming and I could see how this was going further going on and on and on because this time the funnels the funnel were selling the stuff online for me it was not me pushing people but it was the, having the right people coming to my funnel to my automatic selling system and and asking me how to do this so if you're one of those people who wants to know how to do this and how to start your online business adventure just comment below or send me a personal message a direct message or just click on the link if there is the link and I will give you all the informations or if there is a link you click on the link below you will get all the informations that you need and so that you can start today getting your information and with the one final way challenge uh, which will give you the skills to build your own online business without um, having to figure it out how to do but you will just have all the the training you need with coaches 30 days of live um, live coaching and and training and theory and um, uh, practical tasks so that at the end of the one final way challenge you will have your own own uh, funnel built ready to sell what you want to sell uh, or promote online which could be something you have already or something if you don't have anything that you can get uh, from another from uh, from a company who has already product service that, uh, to sell and yeah uh, so that you can start having um, an income in especially in, the, in these times um, where at the moment there is the lockdown but especially when the lockdown will finish especially later because anyway we are going to, to to we are going back to our normal life and the same problems that we had the, when we could work in normal jobs will come back and we will need anyway an extra income stream now we need a, a majority of us need a, a main income stream staying at home and working from home but later uh, we will need anyway an extra income stream because 
the jobs will start again, but not a full regime, regime, a, a full regimen, you know. And so it will slow, start to slow, and so on. So people will start with jobs, but um, will uh, earn a little bit, a little bit, and the economy ha will have to start again, moving, you know, and so on. So it will be basically it will be the, our main stream online business and then it will be a, a su support stream with our normal jobs but for the one of us who are uh, who likes the one of us who like to be independent financially independent this is the best moment to start because this is where you can be totally focused on your online business because there is nothing other that we can do and so if you are one of them if you want to start today to to start to have your own online business just click on the link below send me us a personal message a direct message or comment below in uh, in in the post in this post and i will give you the information that you want okay so thank you for your patience I appreciate it very much and we will see us in the next video. Okay? Ciao!